Alright, I haven't been back to this game in quite a long time, actually. Uh, I, I, cause that's because I kind of recorded a lot of videos, and then I've been slowly uploading them, so I really haven't gone back to the game. And I'm back now. And the reason is because I was thinking just the other day, uh, I wonder what Team Ninja is actually up to. Because, um, obviously they said that they weren't going to be making another Neo game, as in they, they said that Neo 2 was going to be th the last one. Uh, and, of course, I was thinking that, and then a few days later, I see that they're going to be making a Souls-like Final Fantasy game for the PS5? Like, what? So, so they're going to be... Like, if rumors are to be, are to be believed, it's like, I think this even has a name, like Final Fantasy Origins or something. And it's going to have, like, action gameplay, kind of like, a, kind of like the Neo games. So that, that's going to be kind of cool. So if we can get like more Neo style gameplay, but for like in the world of Final Fantasy, I think that would be pretty awesome. Uh, but anyway, let's go ahead and I think we can kind of finish up this area. Uh, we only have three missions left. Missions, I, I said that weird. We only have three missions left and this one is locked. And we have these two right here. We have the Golden Nason and the Demon King's Blade. Uh, they're both level 74, so... Oh, yeah. Okay. This is the Demon's King Blade, so this is where we have to fight Oda Nobunaga himself. Uh, so I really start with this? <sighs> I guess so. I mean, I, I am pretty high level, so hopefully it won't be too bad. Hide, I want you to come. I want you to draw your sword and come at me as if I were your greatest enemy. What's the matter? Don't look so bewildered. I only wish to know the full extent of the power you possess as a siffling. Come, there's no need to hold back. All right, yeah, we fought Oda Nobunaga in the first game, but like it was his spirit or something who was like brought back to life, and he was pretty tough in that game. So. I guess we're gonna actually be gonna be fighting him in this game as he's alive. <sighs> and because I'm just a giant cheater, uh, I'm gonna do this. <laughs> oh, I still have my Ad Adotsi here. And yeah, whatever, that's fine. Okay, you know, you know what? Let me use my sword. Oh, jeez. That did a lot of damage to me. Alright, Oda... Oda... Oda didn't mess around, does he? I like his Guardian Spirit, the uh... Although, then he does these like really lame combos, like come on dude. But then I can just stab him like that, so it's... I don't know, it's pretty... not too bad. But when he starts doing his special moves, yeah, see, look, there's there's the peacock. That's the one I'm, I'm aware of. Oh my god, he, he punishes me. He punishes me with that. Oh, please don't do electricity. I do not want to be slow down. Alright, well, I mean, he's almost dead, so... Yeah, there we go. <laughs> the stupid music. But, I mean, hey, at least we got to see all his forms. I mean, I think that's all his forms. I actually think he has, uh... God, I think he has, like, all the elements? I'm not sure. I just know that he's, like, way harder in, uh, the first game. But that, that's to be expected. He's like, you fight him at like pretty much near the end of the main game.
as this peacock flies through the, uh, clips through the uh, scenery. Alright, possessed by Tengen Kujaku. Well, I, I don't get his, uh. I don't get his, like, lion? Or a tiger, whatever it was. But yeah, he's. I don't know, it's. Uh, th here's the thing is that, you know, I'm, I'm so high level with, like, so high level equipment that that probably. <laughs> my character. Uh, that, that, that probably was a lot easier than it was intended to be. Like, it was probably a lot harder, but because of my level and armor, the fight wasn't that much of a challenge. The fighting was okay, but it wasn't much of a challenge. I have to say that every time. Ah, so that is the power that, that yokai yield. Well, that was most enjoyable. If you ever want to fight again, I will gladly take on the challenge. Yeah, I mean, I mean, Oda's, Oda's pretty cool because it's like he 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 can pretty much use almost every element, and that's pretty useful. Remind me to check out his uh, his guardian spirit and see if that's anything good. Anyway, uh, let's go ahead and do the golden nation. Thanks to the visionary leaders of the Lord Nobunaga, our nation has seen an increase in traders visiting from foreign soil, adding to the bustle of our towns. However, it appears one of the envoys sent by Lord Nobunaga to oversee the inspection of goods has not returned. I sense that something out of the ordinary has taken place. Would you mind looking into the matter for me? So there's actually three Kodama in this level, because this is a brand new level. Missionaries travel from afar beyond the islands of the east to build a house dedicated to our god on foreign soil. The church, which is a remodeled Japanese-style Buddhist temple, was named Nanbanzi. Huh, I wonder what kind of religion. I wonder if it's uh, Christianity or something. I, I, you know what, I think it is Christianity, because I think we, we learned that later. So this is a new level here. Ooh, what is this? Why is there a thing all the way over here? Okay. This is a pretty pretty good level, I I seem to recall. Um, did I get anything good from that fight? Yes, I think I did. I think I'd rather use this. Yeah, I'll, I'll use the Star Cutter Sword because I think when it uh, at full familiarity, it's, it's going to be better than the Smirk Wiper that I have right now. Okay, I think that's I think that's fine. Uh, was there anything else? No. Uh, actually, actually, I don't think about it. Let me uh, let me switch my Kodama sensor just so we won't miss him in the level. Uh, yeah, I don't, I don't need a, I don't need to do anything quite yet. Uh, Tenken Kujaku, that is a phantom, so I'm probably not going to use that, but let's see how it looks. Stance, space, and Rita bonus. What is this? Has a temporary special effect depending on the stance you are in while you absorb and Rita. Increase attack for high stance, increase defense for normal, and increase key recovery for low stance. Oh, that's kind of cool. That, that definitely does help both of those stances. Huh. Extended elemental weapon. 
Oh, what is that? If I had dexterity and skill higher, I could get uh, enemy, treasure, and Rita and Kodama all appear on my compass. Okay, that is a little bit overpowered. The fact that you can see everything, everything like interactable on the map on your little uh, mini, on your little mini map compass, if you have this thing on, that's quite a lot. That is quite a lot. Um, wow. You know what? I don't think I, I, I ever took the time to actually read that to read that description. So I don't think I, I ever knew that. Look at me just walking into a room without checking the roof first. Something could have been up there. Yeah, that that's crazy. I have I have something I have something on my radar. I think I have some sort of Amrita sensor on here. Because I think that's what those yellow dots are. Oh also I'm pretty sure every single enemy here is is a yokai. So this guy is Snakehead. Yeah. Gee, how did I know he was a snakehead? Um, I can't get to him, can I? You know what? I'm just gonna take him out now. Because I realized oh wait, hold on, there's a, there's the steps right here. I didn't know if I didn't know if I could get back up, okay? So as you can see, this place is kind of like set up around a central garden with like lo with a uh, with a bunch of rooms around the side here, and also that big house over there. Yeah, I was scared I wasn't gonna be able to to get up this because look, oh no, it comes up to my chest. However, will I get up? I I, I can't I can't jump. What am I? What am I? What am I? Mario? Come on, that's in that kind of game. This isn't a side scroller. Neo 3, the side scroller. Neo 4, the infinite runner on on mobile. I can I can just keep thinking about thinking up the, these games forever. Oh, that was actually a human. Actually, I think that was a ninja. Yeah, that was definitely a ninja. Which is weird because normally you're normally ninjas are the ones attacking you. You often don't really get a chance to sneak up on ninjas. Wow. Wow, 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 wow. So what you're telling me what what just happened right at that second was that I did my counter. And it missed because he was on the other side of the wall. But he was still hitting me with his axe? Oh, okay. Yeah, thanks. I thought you were supposed to give it to the player when that kind of stuff happens, not side with the enemy. He was seriously swinging his axe on this side of the wall, and I couldn't hit him with my burst counter, but his axe could still hit me multiple times. I'm surprised I didn't die from that, honestly. Ooh, is this enemy? Have you seen this enemy before? I think we have. Oh man! Well, I like how she caresses me before before she like stabs me in my neck. That's, actually, that didn't really do like any damage. I just know that like these harpy ladies have a lot of HP for some reason. And they carry around like a bundle of Amrita, I think. I think it is. I think that's a lore. Is that like they actually carry around some Amrita that they think is your child. So when you like break it, they go they go all crazy. Yeah, you you just gotta you just kinda gotta know that like there there are all these doors here that kinda blend into the walls. 
So you got you kind of got to know that there are doors there that you can just destroy and move, move past. I remember first coming to this level and I didn't know that there were there were these doors here. But yeah, for for some reason those women yokai seem to have a lot of HP for some reason. I don't know. Oh speaking of women yokai, there's another annoying one, the ghosts. Yeah, I don't. I don't know. Even though I have the option to do a backstab on the on on like yokai like that, I often don't do it because I feel like I can just get more damage on them if I do like a high stance combo on them or something, rather than just poking them in the back with my sword or whatever. Because the the thing is that when you do that with a human, it usually does a ton of damage and it stuns them. If you do a back attack, if you if you do a back attack on a uh, on like a yokai, oh, I do not want to get hit by that. It just kind of pisses them off, and it just kind of gets their attention on you. Yeah, I'm I'm really strong. I feel like I'm I'm really strong for this area. Like enemies are just not doing the damage they should be doing to me. Hello. He's over here doing his Neo One combo. Like that first axe wing, like the the first giant skeleton warrior, he so definitely killed me. But I mean, my uh, see, cause here here's the thing with like this guy, I could I could poke him, and that does a thousand seventy seven one thousand seven hundred damage. But if I would have done a combo on him. I feel like I would have done a lot more damage. Abacus? Huh. Okay, we clear out this area over here. Where do I where do I want to go now? Actually, how do I get on a roof? Oh, you gotta get on a roof from from the, from the garden. Okay, because I'm pretty sure that like getting on the roof here is kind of where you kind of where you want to be heading to. Oh my God, this ninja, the ninja did it. Ninjas and skeleton warriors teaming up. Look at this unlikely duo. This is crazy. I mean, you attack me together, you're gonna die together. This is what the Odatsi is for. That wouldn't really work in real life, but in the, in the game. Yeah, saucing at multiple people in real life not really gonna help. Not really gonna happen too uh, too much. But in a video game where your attack is gonna go through no matter what, yeah. It it will it will hit multiple people. Okay. Yeah, does it does this need a key? It does not need a key. Okay. You you know what's bad. I haven't been looking out for uh, for Kodamas. 
That's that's really bad, honestly. I haven't been looking for Gron for Grodamas at all. I haven't been paying attention in the slightest. Um, so there's actually a Kodama right there that I can see with my own two eyes. I know, that's crazy. Uh, let's go clear out the Central Garden, I guess. Because we need to do that. So we can get access to that ladder over there. But first, let's, uh, let's, get, this, uh, let's get this Kodama. He's just chilling out in this garden. Kodama, the, 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 why are you lost? Why are you lost? Your home is literally right here. I can see it with my own cat girl eyes. Or, uh, eye, I guess. Okay, I, I, I just, I would rather not, like, pull both of them if I can help it. The only thing good that, like, backstabbing does is it does take away- Oh, okay, thanks. Well, I didn't get it so off there, but... Backstabbing does take off a lot- a huge amount of, uh, stamina. So it does tire them out pretty fast. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> Oh, okay. I guess he walked away from me too fast. That was really close. That was pretty close. Oh boy, arrows? Really? That's it? Okay, so so we know so we already got one Kodama. We we know where the second one is, but kind of need to find out where that third one is. I bet it's probably in this building over here. Oh, I forgot I had that as my uh Do a little bit of fire on this guy because he's going to be weak to it. Yeah, look at that. He's already done. I probably could just let the fire kill him. But that would be too slow. Alright, is that it for the uh, courtyard area? I think so. Not really too much. I know that we, we come back to this level at least once or twice. And at one point we do fight like a uh, a boss here. A boss that we haven't seen, so I probably shouldn't really talk about that. Alright. Oh, can I not even get in this building? Oh, I probably can't. I don't know if I can even get in this building, honestly. Uh, oh, hi. <laughs> Stupid ninjas. <laughs> oh, ninjas. You guys are so funny. You try and ambush me, and then when you fail, you kind of don't have anything left after that. You just tire yourselves out, and that's that. Um, so I go over here, and actually... Oh, wow. This ninja almost got me. Okay, now you may be wondering how what just happened there, and I think I can explain. What happened there was that I think the ninja jumped at me, but because I was on the higher, but because I was on the high ground, uh, I hit him, and it's one of those rare instances where if you knock an enemy out from a midair attack or like if they're flying, then they just plummet to the ground and just become vulnerable.
Okay. I do not, I absolutely do not want to fall down here. Because that's where the end of the level is, and I want this Kodama. Plus, I still have to find the last Kodama. All right, come on, controls, please. I just need to pivot in place. Kodama, I don't even know how you got here. What is? What, what are you doing? What are you teaching these Kodamas in school? All right. All right, that takes care of that. So I'm glad we were able to get out of the way. So now we have to go over here, and I think there's actually a locked door down there. Yeah, I, I, you know what? I'm thinking that that's a locked door that I just didn't go to. And I think there is a key in this area over here. Oh, here's the last Kodama, just right here, being... Actually, I don't know what he's doing. It looks like he's, like, hiding from the yokai, but the yokai, but the yokai could, could like, clearly see him, so... I don't know. Maybe, maybe, maybe they're friends. Who knows? Oh, that's it for me. No, I'm good. <laughs> always, always a bad time when you get, when you get hit uh, and you have like no stamina. Because you are just kind of screwed until then. All right, well that's all the Kodamas here. I think that's probably all the Kodamas in the, uh, in this world map, I believe. All right, let me go change back to my higher defense one. And here's another example where I could backstab this guy. But I'm just, instead I'm just about to almost die, so. Again, really stupid mistake because I don't know, I just I just like this move. It's like an un it's an uninterruptible uh strong attack. But as you can clearly see, I did get interrupted out of it, so it's not perfect. And I think these guys' weaknesses are their tails, so I know that you can kind of tell, like, if you damage their tail, as in if it's not glowing anymore. Uh, what is this? Is this does this contain a key? No, it doesn't. What am I thinking of? This? Okay, so this is this is that room where we backstabbed the, the ninja. Yeah, so so this is where that uh. Yeah, this is where that body was that we killed the ninja at. There's a lot of stuff in this place. And I'm I swear there was a key here. Okay, well, I mean let's just go try the door then, because Can we even get in here? The door seems locked. Yeah, see, that's what I'm thinking. I'm th I thought there was a key there. Okay, um, yeah, I, I, I'm not sure if, like, that part of the map just isn't used in this, in this level, or what. Okay. Yeah, um, I don't know. I guess let's go ahead and fight whatever inside of here. And we'll see what happens. Because, I mean, obviously we have all three Kodama, so... Honestly, I don't even know why I want to go inside there. We have all three Kodamas, I'm happy. Oh, this guy. It's our old friend! Wow, that was a good shot. Good job, man. I'm proud of you. That was a good shot. We are supportive of our yokai friends.
Oh, I got his horns. I mean, we're supportive, but I mean, we're still gonna kill him. Just in case, do a little bit of safety heal. Oh, I'm gonna throw the ball. Do a little, little, do a little bit of a soft put. Wow, I was blocking that. I really was. I was holding down the block button. Ooh, bit of lag. Wow. Oh, that wasn't the end of it. Okay, so we got a rusty key from that. Lord Spirit's down. Okay. Yeah, I don't know. It's always nice to see it's always nice to see an old friend, isn't it? Even if he attacks us, I mean he's still an old friend. We saw him so much in Neo One and now he's starting to soap more in Neo Two. It, it's good. It's a good thing. Oh, now I remember what this is. Okay. Gotcha. I think I'm... Oh, yeah. Yeah. This is, this is this is why I said that this place was built by uh, Christianity. Because of what this guy is about to say. <laughs> this guy is just in here panting like a lunatic. Don't quite know what I just walked into, but... Uh, I guess we'll talk to him and hear his story. Yeah, see Christian name. So this this is why I think that this place was built by the by uh by Christians. Because he's like, Oh, use my Christian name, Leon. Or as he said, Lee Actually I don't know what he said. I don't know. Lumicide Sard. Ooh, that's a good one. That gives you like what, fifty thousand, I think, or twenty thousand. It's it's a high number. Ano namban shonin domo. Uradewa was that it? Okay. I I like his helmet. I really do like his helmet. It is absolutely ridiculous and I feel like that if you just ram into somebody with your head you'd probably do some pretty good damage oh you know what's cool look at him he, he has dual swords and his helmet is like dual spikes I, I don't think I've ever noticed that that's pretty cool actually what is this back are those like two swans maybe 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 they're geese you know like the completely awful geese Uh. Yeah, I don't know, pr pretty good mission. That, that is a pretty nice and simple level. The main thing is that Lord Oh god. Can I just call him Can I just call him Leon, please? He he asked me, listen, he asked me to call him Leon. I'm going to call him Leon. The main thing is that Lord Leon <laughs> and his party are safe. It would seem that the greed will drive all men, be they from here or from foreign lands, to do evil. If people can need to visit our land with such intentions, then I fear that further war will not be far behind. But what can be done to prevent that from happening? Anyway, you have my thanks. And that of Lord uh, Ujisato as well. Oh, 
Oh, that's not bad. That could replace, like, my giant... That could replace the giant, uh... Cleaver attack I have. I don't know. Um... We'll see. You have accumulated enough astral wisdom to unlock certain sifting skills. What? Why are you just spouting nonsense, game? What is what does that mean? I don't know what that means. Uh I guess let me go to the shrine here and see about trying to level up and everything and I'll get back. Oh wow, that uh that that just put me over enough to level up. What what do I want? Probably not hard for a while. That's giving me all ones. Courage would be pretty good. That gives me plus four defense. Well, yeah, let's go ahead and do courage. Okay. Alright. Oh, what's new to the empty house? There's something new here? Oh. Clan Palace. <laughs> this is so useless. Why would I even do this? I'm gonna be like rank two millionth or whatever. But this is, this is usually what happens. I don't think I've ever seen this off. But uh, yeah, red, red almost always wins. I don't think I've ever seen white ever white win once. But why would they, you know? Is there anything good to donate today? Uh, Gord. I don't know. Uh, okay. Oh, wait, hold on. Do I have any tea sets? I do. Why do I get this? I must have just picked it up when I was spamming the, uh, the pickup button. Are you gonna throw it away? What? That was a family, that was a family heirloom. How dare you? <laughs> That's what happens if they're common, or uh, if, they're, if, they're, if they're basically common. They, he, just, he just throws it away, it's so funny. Alright, so we have one more thing to do here. Let's uh, let's go ahead and get that out of the way, which is actually, I think... What is this? This is actually another one of those DLC missions. So, that's kind of cool. What do we have? Hey, there's a message here for you. Here's what it says. In the silver grass I wait, craving a true rival to test my strength. Hmm, the seal. I believe this belongs to Ujisato Gamo, the man Lord Nobunaga daughter married. I don't know how and when you caught his attention, but this is clearly an invitation. Come now, you wouldn't want to disappoint him, would you? Oh god. Oh. I just I just have PTSD from seeing this field. Fighting the warrior of the West in Neo 1. Oh, it's that guy. Uh Quote unquote Leon. Well, let's give him a. Uh, oh, never mind. I don't have any. Uh, I don't have anything. Yeah. Oh, yeah, but there's the world's slowest bullets. Okay. You're leaving yourself really open for attacks. Like that. That really stupid, uh... Okay, stop, stop trying to suit me, please. God, he's awful. Wow! That was the easiest fight I've ever done. He is awful at this. He leaves himself wide open. He tries to shoot me with a gun. Which, you know, in, in the real world, that would definitely be like, you know... <laughs> in the real world, if somebody tries to shoot you with a gun, you'd probably be dead. But in, in, the, in the game, it doesn't really work out too well because the bullets are so slow. And it doesn't do that much damage. But, yeah, oh my god, dude. That was awful. Did I even... Uh, okay, I think I hit once. But I probably didn't even need, need to do that. Yeah, I mean, take off your helmet, because that probably didn't really help with your, uh... 
you know, balance or whatever. <laughs> Does he even have a guardian spirit? Oh my god. Oh my god, you don't even have a guardian spirit? How embarrassing. That was awful. Why would, why would this even be a fight? Why would this even be a fight? That was so bad. Hitty, you never seen it you never cease to amaze me, but it seems Lord Ujiso Oh Ujisato isn't remotely phased by his defeat and is already taking talking and facing you again. You gotta admire that kind of determination. I guess that's what it takes to become a general worthy of co commanding us an army. I don't know, I kinda worry for him, considering the fact that he was beaten so easily by me. I don't know. I don't know. I mean, I don't know, maybe maybe it's to, like, farm his, uh, his equipment? Like, is his equipment even any good? What is it, uh, luck? Minus 3% damage taken? Plus 5% T utensil drop rate? I mean, I don't, I don't know, is that good? I mean, if you have five pieces, that's plus 70 key, which is pretty good, I guess. But overall, uh, yeah, that was kind of an embarrassing fight. I, I don't know what they had of that. Like I said, it was probably just to farm, farm that armor, I guess. Who knows? Uh, but anyway, I think we're done with this area. Let's just go ahead and move on to the next place, and we'll see what we got going on over there. たちの城が立つ。めでたいよな。これも霊石のおかげってやつか。でも、コニだけはどうも恵まれんようだ。俺が、あの若め野郎の言ってた夢の大将ってやつなのか。<笑> I mean, I do, but I just can't talk for some reason. Unable to produce an hair, Hideyoshi threw himself headfirst into his plot and schemes. Meanwhile, as the Oda clan star continued to rise, the generals of the Akatsuki clan began to assemble in secret. Ooh. All right, so brand new area. So, does he look older? He definitely looks older. So Nobunaga Yes, can I move? Oh, there we go. Okay. 
Yeah, so this is a Twilight Mission I've already done. Uh, the music is a bit more somber than normal. Uh, Tokichiro kind of has this realization that, uh, uh, I don't know, like like he realizes that his his dream of becoming rich and famous is costing a lot of people lives, but it's like he doesn't care or something. I don't know. It's kind of weird. But uh, if you know the first game, then you probably realize where that place they were sitting at, like the little beach area. So, kind of just keep that in mind, and we'll uh, we'll, we'll we'll come to that later. Oh, what is this? Dragon whistle. Ichi no Tani was a famous ancient battlefield during the Genpei War. It said that Minamoto no Yoshitsune left 70 elite men and lots of surprise attack from atop a cliff. That was, suit, that was situated behind the Tyra forces. The Tyra men were sent into such disarray that they could only flee for their lives. Wow. So, uh, yeah, Sato, the last one we were at, that was from 1570 to 1573. So that was a span, so this was a span of seven years. This was the span of three years. This takes place in 1578, so... Five years have already uh, gone on since uh, since the last time <laughs> we spoke, which I guess that means in that time our castle was 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 built. I guess I don't know. Still a while is off until uh, William gets to Japan, but we'll come to that when uh, when it becomes relevant. So for now, let's uh, let's end it here, and I'll see you guys next time, where we'll do pervading waters.